Hey you guys, uh, it's Melanie with Hometown Paints and I thought I would pop on here this morning and paint a little bit with you guys again today. Um, I've been wanting to paint this um, for a while and I figured why not go ahead and do it today. I'm going to start with Sea Breeze and do the background. that out hopefully I have some more <laughs> but I'm just using my favorite little um, angle brush and I went ahead and drew the bunny on the little canvas I'm using another one of those little cheapy Dollar Tree canvases so they call it cost a dollar it's like an 8 by 10 but it works, y'all. It's a stretch canvas. You can hang it right on the wall. And so yesterday, I was telling you guys, you know, it, a blank canvas might seem kind of intimidating. You're like, I don't know what to do. But if you have an idea in your head, you know, draw it out. Just use a normal pencil and draw the outline of whatever it is you're trying to paint and I, I wouldn't suggest this if you're trying to sell a painting but just to practice you could even Google coloring sheets you know and you know or get your kids coloring book and draw those out because those are already just line drawings right So if you don't know, if you're like, I can't even draw, I don't know where to start. That's a good place to start, just to practice. And I can even show you how to trace it on. Not today, I'll have to come on here another day and do that. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and paint the edges as well. So if you're hanging out with me, say hello. Hopefully I can see your comments. I don't have you guys pulled up on my iPad, so just using my phone to record and it's all sideways, so hopefully I can see what you're saying. I did that too far over. So, done. I'm going to put my brush in the water. And now I'm going to get some white and some gray to keep using white until I can't get it out. I don't know. I feel like I have 42 bottles of white with a little bit of white paint in it. <laughs> Which is not ideal. That was just white acrylic paint and I'm gonna get some of this pewter gray. I feel like this is kind of dark because my light is kind of behind my phone. So maybe I need to set this up different. Because this is such a small canvas, I'm just using this same brush all the way through, probably, unless I do a few details. So, I didn't want it just bright white. I wanted it to have a little bit of variation in there. So, just from time to time, I'll grab a little bit of that gray. it in there and I 
that's probably a little too much so I'll just grab some more white and blend and just kind of go in a circle and if you do this and it's too dark then you can go back and paint white over it again later and paint the side over here And that has some green in it, or turquoise, so I'm going to wipe it out. So, it's Friday. Hope you guys have some fun stuff planned this weekend. Anybody doing anything exciting? It won't show me y'all's comments. It'll let me comment. Maybe I'll comment and see what happens. Nope, I can't. Well, I saw mine. <laughs> Facebook's crazy. Speaking of crazy, I don't know. I've just... There's been times, especially this year, that I've just wanted to get off all social media because people can be so, so hateful. And I don't ever talk about stuff like that. I, I don't know. I, I don't talk about it on here. I try to keep this page free from opinions like that there's lots of different things that I follow that are very religious or they talk about uh, politics or religion or whatever and I just I'm not gonna do that on this page pick this up I'm gonna get but with that being said I I don't know. I live in a place that, how am I going to say this? There's <laughs> just people that are not the same as me, and I'm okay with that, but they're not okay with that. <laughs> and it just kind of sucks when people get super hateful. Like, I know that I'm different than most people that are around me and I'm it's fine I you know I don't it is what it is I've lived here my whole life that is just I'm gonna let this dry and then I'm gonna work on the bow but I lived here my whole life and that's just the way it is right but I've never felt like I should completely change who I am and what I think and what I feel and what I believe because it's not the same thing as everyone around me. And I guess that just upsets people. <laughs> Some people. So... Today, I'm just trying to be positive, <laughs> which is not always easy. But honestly, painting helps me a lot. So if you have anxiety or sadness or I don't know whatever if you have if you're just not perfectly happy all the time <laughs> then maybe you should try painting even if you feel like you're not great at it no one has to see it <laughs> you don't have to get on Facebook like I do and like do it 
a lot, you can just get you some paint and um, just do it, you know, just give it a shot. There's a million different videos, like tutorial videos online, you can get on YouTube. I'm trying to get my YouTube going, that's not been something that I've ever, ever, ever messed with. That I thought that was for my children <laughs> and my husband who likes to watch silly videos but my business um, lady was like you gotta have YouTube so I was like oh, okay let me figure that out I'm gonna use some royal fuchsia That's coral. Coral. and cotton candy So anyways, just even if the people are getting you down, sorry, Papa John's was wanting to sell me something. <laughs> Painting can help you divert your energy. It'll make you feel good. You'll get something accomplished. You'll be, uh, you'll probably be pretty proud of what you've done. All right, I'm going to take that darker pink and that lighter pink and try to make a little nose right here, kind of in the middle. And I should probably use a smaller brush for this, but it is what it is. I'm going to use the same colors up here and put in his ears, the pink part of his ears. So you can always go back and any of the live videos I do, you're more than welcome to Pull those back up, pull this one back up, and try to follow along the paint, you know? Just do what I do, just copy it. Um, again, once if you ever start to like want to sell what you're making, then you should not do that. <laughs> you shouldn't copy it. But if you're learning, and if you're just trying to like practice and um, find something to occupy your time, then that's a perfect thing for you to do is just to pick up or to rewatch one of these videos that I've shown. There's other people out there that have lots of video tutorials and um, YouTube also has it. So I am changing brushes. I'm getting a liner brush because I know I can't do that little a liner brush helps you draw lines or like paint lines and I'm kind of looking at his nose right here I want his eyes to be on either side of his nose so that helps me line it up again I could have drawn all this on with pencil at the beginning before I started painting and I did not so there's his little happy smile He's a funny little bunny. Um, I think I'm gonna take a little bit more of that gray. Kind of, well, that was too much. I just wanted it to be darker, but now it's kind of a mess. Oh, 
Sophie. Dog is going bananas. So I want to add some flowers around the edge. So I'm gonna get some greens. I decided to go to Hobby Lobby after this. So I need to get some more greens for sure. So my flowers are going to be yellows and pinks. And um, maybe a purple. Which are almost gone too. I guess I just need to go get all new paint. brush back out and start with some pink you can do this with um, easter eggs around it Just put my first coat of flowers in there because flowers take a few coats and um, just get the placement of all of them and then go back and add the second coats. I'm just going to kind of go around all the edges and Quit. I didn't dry that off enough. So I hope you guys um, can find something that can make you feel good and keep you positive if it's not painting then I'm sure there's something else out there um, I also like to run <laughs> I've done a lot of marathons and I say that I like to do it like I like to do it when I have people to do it with uh, when I want to have friends, like doing that alone kind of stinks, but I signed up for one in Nashville and it got canceled, <laughs> so I'm still trying to figure that out. Go back 
can put some leaves in. Leaves are just like little footballs. I'm using both kinds of greens. I was going to try to offer some Easter kits and then I realized that Easter is like next week so drop the ball on that one. <laughs> Going out of town really, um, I don't know, threw a wrench in my, my life. Hadn't done it in so long. So we still need polka dots on the bow. He still needs some like bunny whiskers. I still need to go back over these flowers. You can decide um, which flower is going to be on top when you do this. Do you want the pink flower on top or the yellow flower on top? Put some white in there. Wipe that out a little bit. I'm going to get some yellow. Since I don't have two different colors of yellow, I'm using a lot of white just to give it some variation. I don't have two different colors of purple, so I'm going to do the same thing. Okay. Um, so little white polka dots. You could use um, the end, this end of your paintbrush, but I'm just going to use my little liner brush and try to not make it look like a pattern, which I struggle with that. <laughs> And then I'm going to just put some little bunny whiskers on here coming out of his nose. And let's see, I might put That might look weird. 
Okay. <laughs> yeah, I want to cover that leg up. That just looks weird. Okay. So we have another bunny. <laughs> Maybe if I can think of lots of different bunnies and I'll go live up until Easter and teach you guys different bunnies. All right, um, that's all we have today. So I hope that you will consider um, painting. I hope you stay positive in this sometimes ugly world. <laughs> know that you can always come here and um, you won't get hated for your opinions and views on things um, and that I won't be shoving that kind of stuff down your throat. That's not, that's not who I am. Um, we're all different and that's what makes this world wonderful and I guess that's all I have to say. <laughs> I'm going to clean up and then go to Hobby Lobby and get me some more green paint and have a good weekend. I hope that you have a good weekend too. And go get you some paint and have a good day.